Good morning. Here is that Super Duty that you inquired on. I didn't see any body damage on it or rust or anything like that. It's got Goodyear Wrangler tires on it. And the tread looks good, so shouldn't have to worry about tires. Running boards. It's got the air ride suspension on it too. You can see. So the last owner put air ride suspension on it and put some like lights in the back here, I guess, to be more visible. Uh, parking sensors, your hitch, plugins for a trailer, light, and a camera on the back here. And it's got a soft tonneau on the back. And key fob looks like this. Oh, inside the bed here. Open it up. You can see, uh, and obviously they'll clean that up better for you. I'll make sure they power wash it. So if you end up getting it, they'll detail it and put a full tank of gas in it. If you want to get a spray in, we have Line X that does those or drop ins. We can do that as well. It does have remote start on the key fob, and you get a code on the door you can use to get in and out. Big tow mirrors with the defrost. Inside, you got the rubber floor mats from Ford, the cream colored leather interior, and it's heated and cold. Uh, power seats with lumbar adjustment. It's got, let's see, the mirrors are power extending, so you can push those in and out when you have the car on. So I'm going to start her up real quick. Two oh nine four six eight current miles. Uh, so service has already gone through this. When we got it, it did have a check engine light on. I can't remember what it was for, but uh, it was running just fine. But they fixed that check engine light, so I can find out exactly what they did to it. Um, Sony sound system. So it's got the nicer sound system. Trailer brake controller. Drive mode selector with locking rear axle. Heated and cold seats, like I was telling you. Dual zone climate control. Uh, climate control settings right here and you can also do it from the uh, screen here as far as audio goes you got AM FM XM CD and Bluetooth it does have 911 assist so if you're in an accident uh, Wi-Fi for your passengers Android Auto and Apple CarPlay when you pair up your phone so mine's a tw I have a 2017 F uh, not F 250 but a uh, Ford and it's got the same system. It's called Sync 3. Uh, when you pair up your phone, it'll have navigation pop up on the screen from Android Auto or, or Apple CarPlay. And you can use different apps like uh, Waze, you know, the Google Maps, the iPhone Maps. A trailer brake controller, like I was saying. Hill descent control. Two USBs. Over here you got 12 volt and a conventional. A little cubby up here. And the the box you got the owner's manual and I guess that's the air red stuff he put in center console change tray 12 volt charger in there and it's pretty deep in there so you can get a lot of stuff our sliding rear window auxiliary switches twin panel moonroof and just so you can see which is fine it's raining of course so I love that and then uh, let's see so you can do halfway and then it goes all the way if you keep holding it uh, let's see memory seats fog lights automatic headlights light on the back of the cab lights on the side of the mirror yeah on the mirrors um, cruise control hands-free calling and speak button. So with that speak button, you can say like FM 97.9, navigate to Home Depot, stuff like that. Especially when you have Android Auto and Apple CarPlay enabled. Uh, tow haul mode, shift the gears yourself if you want. Uh, see anything I missed over here. XM radios usually free for 90 days. After that, you'll have to pay for it. Uh, I'll show you the back real quick. Let me jump out. Back. 
underneath. So this comes up, it's like a locking, you can do that, and then pull this up, and it comes out like a uh, storage thing you can use. Those are the tools and stuff. Uh, let's see, in the back you got several power points for your passengers as well. And there's lots of space back here, so my brother uses, uh, he has a Super Duty and he puts all these pack out boxes back here to keep them uh, safe from being like stolen and stuff. Any other questions, feel free to call me, 614-502-7621. Again, my name is Nick. You're welcome to come in, test drive it, see what you think. Uh, if you have a trade, we do take in trades. Just going around it one more time for you. Let me know what you think. Thanks.